guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Shan from Home With Shan over on Instagram. I post loads of stuff over on there and on here about motherhood life. So I would love if you could subscribe and stick around, join the family. There's almost 14,000 of us, which is insane. Um, absolutely insane and I'm so, so grateful for our growing community. But today's video is gonna be my top 10 holy grail baby products that I absolutely love and they're not essentials i'm gonna stay away from that word because they're not baby essentials because i've got videos all about what i think are the absolute essentials for us but they're things that i love i really really love these things and i want to share them with you because they're not essentials but they're things that i use every single day george uses every single day george is my son who's eight months old by the way if you are new and i think they're so worth buying they make your life so much easier and yeah so I'm going to stop waffling and I'm going to get straight in to the top 10 holy grail baby products that I absolutely love. Okay, number one holy grail baby item is a portable changing mat. Oh yes, this thing has been very well used. I bought mine from Aldi when they had a baby event on at some point when I was pregnant. They do have those on every now and then, but they don't always have them in stock. If they do, I'll link it down below. If they don't, however, loads and loads of them are on Amazon, and I'll link a couple of them down below because they are just as good. A portable changing mat, have all your nappies in, you've got wipes in there, like a little wipe compartment, and it's just, the best thing it's the best thing for if you're changing a nappy in the car changing a nappy around a friend's house or you're changing a nappy in a garden somewhere in a park and you just honestly it's the best thing i have it everywhere we go even if i don't even take out my changing bag i'll just take my changing mat with me because it folds up quite compact it's obviously got the wipes in it it's got the nappies in it you've got everything that you could possibly need i think it's such a must-have for everyone and this one i do think is an essential to be fair but it just has made my life so much easier number two on my top 10 holy grail baby items list is zip baby grows you have probably noticed me talking a lot about zip baby grows recently and that's because they are a revelation they are so so useful especially when your baby gets to this age the age that george is at which is eight months he is so wriggly i can barely keep him still to put a nappy on him let alone do poppers up the baby grow no 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 zip baby grows are just so much easier and they don't have to be too expensive the ones in asda for example they do three for 11 pounds which is not expensive at all for zip baby grows i know a lot of them can be expensive but i also know in primark they do two for eight pounds they are really really cute patterns on them as well so definitely shop around but zip baby grows are an absolute must for me definitely deserve a place on the top 10 holy grail baby items number three is our baby zen yo-yo 2 stroller now i think this is such a good stroller i just i love the compactness of it i love how tiny it goes into the boot it literally takes up i've got a mini bear in mind it takes up a quarter of my boot barely not even that it's so so compact folds up like that thin if that it's, it's ridiculous, it's so good. I love how easy it is to flip out. You do it with one hand, you can have the baby in one arm, flip out the stroller, pop them in it. It's so simple. I do think for a six month plus baby, just the front facing stroller, Baby Zen Yo-Yo 2 is like, the best thing and i think to be honest it's the main one that we use even though it's supposed to be marketed as a travel stroller we tend to use it quite frequently and i have even used it at an animal park and things so i've gone over like what you know i've gone over fields and things like that and it does actually work really really well you don't have to be in a really urban area for it to work i think it's such a good stroller and i just think people need to know about it basically so i did want to include it on this list if you want a good stroller that is compact check it out maybe go and test it out in a shop or something like that um i'll link a couple down below we've got like the navy color but they do loads of really cool colors in it as well i just think it is worth a look it definitely is if you're looking for a compact stroller which i think most modern families need because we don't have loads of storage everywhere so yeah i love something that allows my life to be slightly less cluttered and that is what that does number four on my top 10 holy grail baby products list is a travel cot 
and a travel cot mattress. I'm gonna add these two together because we've used that a lot so far and we've barely even gone traveling, but it's just so easy to have something that just folds out, it's all in one. This one I did have to purchase another mattress for, which I don't think you have to do, it's just the mattress in it wasn't amazing, but the cot was literally 30 pounds and then the mattress was like 20 pounds, so it's 50 pounds in total for a travel cot is really not bad. But what I would say is if I'd have known about travel cots or like had researched about travel cots a little bit more i would have got the graco travel cot and used it for our next to me crib instead of actually buying an next to me crib because i just think if you're going to have a travel cot anyway and they're going to sleep in it the graco one you can have risen so if they're newborn you can have them high up and then when they're a little bit older you can drop it down you could just have that next to your bed I keep putting over there because that's where our next to me crib used to be I would just use that instead because what's the point in having a next to me crib and a cot and a travel cot? You don't need that many things, you really don't. So having something that's like more versatile like the Graco travel cot, which I'll link down below, I'll link everything that I mentioned down below, genuinely just does the trick. It really, really does. That is exactly what I would tell myself if I were me eight months ago. <laughs> Number five on my top 10 baby items is definitely got to be my totter and tumble play mat. Now I love this thing. I absolutely love it. I talk about it all the time and I get so many questions about it whenever I've ha had it in a vlog, had it in a picture on my stories. It's always like, where did you get your rug from? And it's not a rug, it's a play mat. And that's the beauty of it because it doesn't look like a play mat. It's not gay it's not bright it's really neutral it's beautiful it looks really nice but you can wipe it clean George's ate on there before and you know then I just wipe it up really really simply the thing is we've got a dog and a cat I can't be having rugs everywhere or carpet everywhere because the dog and the cat's hair just gets everywhere and then George is crawling now it's just not really you can't really have that unless I want to be hoovering every five seconds so the totter and tumble play mat is so good for that I also think if you've got hardwood floors it's really good because you can like allow your baby to sit up on it maybe if they're like you know six seven months old and they're sitting they're just about sitting up but you don't want them to fall over George has hit his head off of that so many times that actually he's never cried other than like once maybe when he was really tired um he, he never cried when he hits his head on it you know it's really really safe squidgy the, the feel of it is like really luxury as well we got the bigger version so there's like a small one like a, a compact one and then a standard one and the standard one is the one that we got we got the one called globe trotter and i'll link it down below but they've got so many really nice patterns they just look so good they are a little bit expensive let's not lie they are expensive for a play mat but think about it this way if you were buying a rug you would spend that amount of money and this is better than a rug in my opinion. I would have this in my living room even way beyond George is playing on it because it looks nice and you can wipe it clean. I mean, is that not way better than a rug? I feel like it is. <laughs> Number six on my top 10 baby items list is the Mamas and Papas Activity Center chair that we had for George. So George got this over Christmas when he was three months old. He's now eight months old and he's still absolutely loving it. I don't think it's suitable for babies under the age of three months or under the age of where they've got full like neck control but after that i think it's totally like it's so good to just pop them in and it's somewhere for them to sit it's somewhere for them to practice their sitting as well it grows with them so so easily because you, there's an insert inside it and when their like legs get too chunky you can take that out and it can grow with them even more it's got the activity center on it and i remember when george was first like in it he would he wouldn't even barely look at the stuff and he'd randomly like hit the things but now he absolutely loves it he looks in the mirror he folds the book over he like hits the daisy whatever else is in front of it he loves all of that stuff but you can also because it's a suction cup you can take that bit off and he can eat on it so it's a like acts as a high chair if you've seen my vlogs you'll know that george always eats you know his breakfast on that or have a snack on it every now and then he has got a high chair but the mamas and papas chair has served us so well like so well that i couldn't not include it in this number seven on my top 10 baby items holy grail list has got to be the ergo baby 360 omni baby carrier how could i not include this on the video i use it every single day without fail i think it's the best invention ever it's so so practical so versatile like it will grow with your baby you can actually use it from newborn 
until the age of four or something ridiculous like that. It is so good. I just think you can have him on the front, facing in, facing out. You can have him on the back when he's older. It's so ergonomic. You're never going to hurt your back with it. I just think it is a really, really good item. Plus, they've got a new version out, which is actually something that I've been sent from Ergo Baby themselves. I actually gave away my baby carrier, my old one that we purchased, in a giveaway recently because they sent me a new one. So I thought I would give it away to you guys. But I just wanted to share the love on this because the Ergo Baby 3 360 Omni is just fantastic it really is it's so comfortable it's so good to have a baby carrier that's so easy to put on I just I just can't say enough good things about it I talk about it a lot I know you probably get bored of it but I just love it I just think everyone should have one really genuinely everyone should have one if it's the one thing that you splurge on if it's something that maybe you get like as a present when your baby's born and you get like all your family to like chip in a little bit or something it is expensive 150 pounds for a baby carrier I feel like it is expensive but it has absolutely changed our lives so i definitely recommend it number eight holy grail baby item has got to be a blackout blind i mean the blackout blind guys let me tell you a little story about the blackout blind it has saved us and it's saved our nap times and our morning wake ups more times than i can count i think maybe i'm maybe i'm losing the plot maybe it's just georgia's good sleep or whatever but it's got to be something to do that blackout blind because as soon as we started using it guess who started sleeping well is that is that you know i feel like that is not a coincidence we use a suction cup blackout blind which is again portable which was really important to me because we move a lot around a lot because of my partners work so to have a port anything that's portable is fantastic in my book i'm not buying something specifically for this house when we're not going to stay here for that long okay george has come to join us number nine on my holy grail baby product <laughs> list is definitely george's new car seat i absolutely love this thing and it's really affordable for what it is so george's new car seat is the Graco turn to me rotating car seat. It's really, really good. It's really sturdy and it only retails at £150. It was gifted to us, but I would 100% buy it having used it now. Like it is so good. It comes with the Isofix base. It turns like directly to you so you can put them in and then turn them back. And you can have it front facing, forward facing back facing everything rear facing whatever it's called it's really really good i definitely think that is one of our top 10 baby items george is just trying to grab the tripod stop it <laughs> this is why i try and film when you're not here darling his car seat is definitely one of my favorite things that we've got at the moment isn't it babe there's one more thing to talk about and then we'll go and have a play time okay yeah Okay, the last one that I wanted to talk to you guys about, and I think this is going to be a controversial one, that everyone agrees with me on this, but I absolutely love, I think it's one of the best things that we've bought, I absolutely love our snooze shade. So this is a basically essentially a blackout blind for on the go, like for your stroller, but it's breathable, it's not going to like suffocate them or anything like that, as well as like blacking out basically, giving them a blackout blind on the go, which let's face it, if George didn't have a blackout blind in his bedroom, maybe he wouldn't need one on the go. So maybe I've spoiled him in that aspect maybe with like giving him a completely blacked out room, but I just love when he naps well. So anything that I can do to help him with naps, is really really handy and naps on the go is something that we were really really struggling with but since we had the snoo shade once we're on the go with that he's got the snoo shade on um and he just falls asleep straight away because he hasn't got any of the other like distractions i guess when it comes to him sitting up usually and looking at the world there's no chance he's going to go to sleep and then he's going to be so miserable throughout the rest of the day if he doesn't have his nap so the snoo shade saved us it really really has if you've got to get out of the house at a certain time or whatever just by having the snoo shade he definitely gets his nap at the right time i stay sane he stays sane everyone is happy okay guys they are our top 10 holy grail baby items that we've used i think everyone would really benefit from them either benefit from them or just love them if you had them i'm not saying they're essential items absolutely they're not you can get by with other things um more affordable things potentially or things that would suit you a little bit more but for us those items are things that i absolutely love and use every single day and think oh this is a good thing i'm glad i've got this that totter and tumble play mat for example the amount of times i go to ash how good is this this is so good and he agrees it's re it really really is good isn't it 
I think though we're gonna go and play on it now but let me know what your like favorite baby items are like I said I stayed away from like formula feeding or bottle feeding ones on this one because I wanted to, it to be like a really universal video but if you have any specific bottle feeding formula feeding or breastfeeding um, baby favorites like items that you really really love and couldn't use like couldn't live without then let me know what they are below i would love to read them i love seeing what your guys's suggestions are and things like that as well but for now let's go and have a little play bye everyone bye see you later bye because you glue all the pieces back together yeah you you take all my wrongs and make them better yeah you you're making me wanna try forever and i feel so free Oh, my sweet baby